Hey, it's Marcus at Elite, and today we're going to talk about plantar fasciitis. Plantar fasciitis is one of the most common causes of foot pain that we see in the clinic. Um, this is also one of the most common foot diagnoses in the U United States. One in ten people are diagnosed with plantar fasciitis, with most people being between the ages of 45 and 64. Some risk factors for this are being overweight, having poor ankle range of motion, or a job that requires you to be on your feet for long periods of time. Plantar fasciitis is the inflammation of a large band of tissue that runs from your heel bone to your toe bones. Uh, this tissue is called your plantar fascia, which is why it's plantar fasciitis. It's an inflammation of this tissue. The most common ways that this is treated is by use of orthotic devices in your shoes, um, stretching, which we've found that stretching in a weight bearing or by standing on your feet is the best way. Other methods include taping the area to kind of act like an orthotic device which is slightly more comfortable with the tape. Today I'm going to show you a way that we use dry needling to reduce pain in the heel that's often associated with plantar fasciitis. So the first thing I'm going to do is clean the area with rubbing alcohol. And although we're not needling directly in the bottom of the foot where plantar fasciitis pain is often at, this will help relieve symptoms at the heel. So with needling, at most, you feel a little stick with some pressure in the muscle. So give you a little tap, it's a needle inside the skin, we're going to advance that needle into the muscle belly. Two more. So with this technique, we are getting both sides of the calf muscles. So this is just one way that we use dry needling, but we've found it very effective for treating plantar fasciitis. Other uses for needling are reducing pain or improving motion in other parts of the body. So although I showed dry needling as a treatment for plantar fasciitis, we do many things if you're a little afraid of needles. Um, I mentioned other treatment options, which includes taping, orthotics, and stretching. Um, if you feel like we can help you with this or you have this pain, please don't sit at home and suffer. Feel free to come see us, and uh, we'll see if we can help you out.